now our motor determine equivalent capacitance between a and b so how can we determine first of all check series and parallel okay if you check here then this one this one this one in easy way not look like series or parallel so but this one look like series so first of all redraw the redraw the circuit okay redraw the circuit that is c c c and that is c by 2 and that is c that is c by 2 c c c c okay now this one this one and this one has connected that is b point and that is a okay now this if this one is potential a that is same a why because of no capacitor or resistance connected between this wire so potential difference between this wire is zero okay ideal wire if ideal wire if not question not given any corresponding to this wire resistance or capacitance then we are consider always zero resistance it means potential difference between this point and this point is zero so both are uh, represent same potential that's why make it okay now another way that is represent that point consider d this is also d and this is also d okay this potential difference between this <coughs> plate that is zero so no charge flow from left to right or right to left okay so that is dummy capacitor so not bonding for equivalent capacitance between a and b so now next one is make the another circuit a that is d and that is b a and d that is c capacitor another d to a another connected to c capacitor okay now a to d another connected to c capacitor that is c c c and d to b another capacitor connected to okay that is c so c of a b that is finally 3 c and this is c so both are connected in series so 3 c into c divided by 4 c so 3 c by 4 is the right answer make it